This is an Ellis Mowers and More small engine vlog. Stay connected on Instagram and Facebook at Ellis Mowers and More. Comments or questions? Leave them below or email me, ellis at ellismowers.com. And as always, like and subscribe for more small engine content. On today's repair video, product review, giveaway. How about that? Let's do a giveaway on this video here. Hypa has been awesome. I've been partnered with them for nearly two years now. And they reached out and said, hey, we've got a, you know, a big sale going on on our saw chains. And more, more particularly like the 10 inch saw chains, which worked out perfectly because I just got this Remington pole saw on trade not too long ago. They're like, hey, you want to you do a giveaway? I said, sure, let's do it. So here's what's going to happen. We're going to fix this Remington pole saw. And all y'all got to do to win something is comment what your favorite brand of chainsaw is down in the description below. What, uh, yeah, that's all you need to do because this is going to be open to international winners and winners in the United States. So that's going to be fantastic for you all. Everybody who's watching this video has an opportunity to win, which is uh, excellent. So what you could potentially win is either this uh, 40 drive length chainsaw chain, 10 inch, 39 inch chainsaw chain, 10 inch. I think we've got three of the 40 uh, drive lengths and two of the 39 inch drive lengths. They're gonna come to you uh, in a 100% off coupon from Hypa, you'll just give me your email address uh, if you win. And I will get that to you. Uh, on today's giveaway, it's going to be a little bit of a repair, a little bit of a product review, and the big thing is a giveaway on this video. Hypa, y'all know, have has been a great partner for me for going on two years now. They sell, uh, they're one of the leading aftermarket suppliers in small engine parts, especially on Amazon. And uh, they have their own website, hypastore.com. I have links down below, not only to uh, the chainsaw chains that I'm going to present, but um, to their uh, website in general. Uh, if you find something on there, they got carb kits for everything under the sun. Uh, even some of the more uh, obscure items like old home light weed eaters and uh, things along that nature. They got a ton of chainsaw chains though. They're running a sale right now on them, particularly the ones for this 10 inch uh, saw uh, bar or the 10 inch chains. Worked out perfectly because I have this Remington pole saw I got on trade a few, uh, about a month ago now. And uh, I'm going to keep this around the house to use, which is great. Um, and so what you could win, and it's going to come in the form of a 100% off coupon, but you could win this 39-inch drive link chain. We've got two of them to give away. A 40-inch drive link chain. There's three of them to give away. And then we've also got uh, everyone who wins the chains, I'll send you all one of these hype uh, hammer bottle opener keychains. They're really cool with their website and stuff along those lines. I've got 10 of them total. Five of them are going to go out to the winners of the chain and then we'll have five separate ones that will just go out to other winners. The only thing that you need to do in this video to win one of these items or to be entered to win one of these items, we will be doing the drawing. Let's see. Today is Wednesday. July 12th. We will run this giveaway until my Sunday video comes out on the channel at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. That's when the sweepstakes will close. I will announce the winners that following Monday, which would be, if I can do some math, that's going to be July 17th that evening. So I'll let you know what you need to do in that video if you win. Just let me know your favorite brand of chainsaw. 
And uh, that's all you need to put down in the comments section. If you put a brand of chainsaw down there, you can be living in the United States. You could be living internationally. The only difference would be if you live in the United States and you win the 100% off coupon for this, you'll get free shipping. If you're international and win the coupon, you'll have to pay for um, international shipping. That's the only difference. But um, if you win just one of the keychains, I'll put the bill for the shipping, uh, whether domestically or internationally. So got 10 of them to give away. I think that's all the guidelines here again. Favorite brand of chainsaw. We all know hypo has got some good products. I've featured them plenty of times on this channel. Links to this and this down in the description below and also a link just directly to their website. If y'all buy uh, parts using those links, even if you click on the links, I still get a couple of pennies. I mean, any, any little bit helps. Um, Hype has been a great partner. Happy to do this giveaway. What we're going to do in this video is this Remington pole saw. It is a 40 drive link chain on this 10 inch bar. Uh, some things I learned because I don't really do a bunch of chainsaw stuff here in the shop because I mostly focus on lawn tractors, push mowers, and sometimes I do weed eaters and other uh, outdoor equipment. Lead the chainsaws to uh, a little bit more professionals. You have different drive links for different manufacturers and different bars. So there's a 10 inch bar here. This is a 40 drive, in drive link. But then there are 10 inch bars that have 39 inch drive links. Like I think Echo and a couple other manufacturers use 39 inch drive links. On this particular chain itself, Hype has got this cool little, um, talking about pitch and gauge, your chain codes on their uh, website. The file says that you need to sharpen it, the filing angle, the file position in terms of the degrees and then the depth gauge. Just showing you everything along that line. Super helpful for when you want to maintain these chains after they get dull, after you've used them a little while. So that's really cool that they put that on the back of this. And you just gotta know, you know, look up your saw number. Don't just go buy a 10 inch chainsaw chain. Know what you need. Um, how many drive links? What's the pitch and what's the gauge that you want or need? The drive links are a must. The pitch and the gauge, you can kind of determine uh, what you want to do there, depending on what type of cut that you need. And there's probably plenty of resources out there for you to research on that. Anyways, I'll stop talking. Again, y'all know I really do appreciate Hypa for doing this for a little channel like mine and for all of y'all watching. So, let me get this Remington Pulse already. We're going to get this thing, this chain swapped out. We're going to try it out because I've got plenty of foliage to cut around here. So, let's do it. Honestly, we'll just do this, do this right here on the ground. So, like I said, this is the 40 link drive link chain. Ready to rock and roll from Hypo. What I really like is that they put their uh, logo inside the chain, which is really... A nice touch. Um, again, y'all know as good as I do that most everything comes from overseas now. And uh, you just don't want to buy something generic from overseas. You want to buy something that actually has a little bit of product support. These guys have been fantastic in terms of product support. Eddie Christie is their U.S. rep representative and I will get this untangled at some point but until that time we're just going to take this chain off here super easy to do it's just unscrewing this uh, bolt that goes onto this and then just pull it out and you can see this one this is set up for a little bit this chain it's probably still in pretty good shape. It has been used a little bit, but no biggie. Um, could probably use Sharpen, but Hyper was generous enough to send me a new chain for it. So that's easy, easy squeezy to do here. We are going to do our best to get this untangled. So let me keep on cruising here. 
see if we can get this thing untangled. I think I'm trying to make it worse here, aren't I? Either way, you know, y'all love, you know, you love it when this stuff like this happens, right? You're sitting there like, come on now. I'm going to get this untangled. When I get it untangled, guys, I will come back to y'all. We'll put it on. We'll test this out. All right, guys, so we got it. One thing you need to make sure, because I made the mistake the first time, make sure that you got it going the right way. You want to have the the this end going around the front or the top side of the saw because if you have the flat end like if this end's going forth it's dull and it you're you're going to think there's something wrong with the chain i don't know why i make that mistake a lot i just did on this machine might be because i have not slipped very well recently However, we're powering through. We're going to put this on. Again, if this didn't have the right drive lengths, then it wouldn't slide in and you'd be eating up your bar, screwing your bar up. Even if it did attempt to fit in there, everything would be just a tinge off and it really would honestly wear everything out really quickly. So we've got it in the correct way now and then I've just got to pull the bar out as I push the chain in here, or push this down. You're going to have a little bit of play on it. You want it to be tight, but Could have maybe tinged tighter than that, but all things considered, that'll work. And what I'm going to do, I just got to fill up some bar and chain oil right here. I'll get a find a limb or two that we can cut down, and I will uh, we'll see together how it goes. Wanted to mention to y'all, I made one mistake on the assembly because it's my first Remington like this. Um, before you lock this down like I did, you want to turn it, and that will get the chain nice and tight. Once you get it turned nice and tight, you go ahead and lock it down, and you, we should be good now. So, we're going to test this out. We've got a little bit of oil on the chain, uh, pre-lubed it, and we've got this willow tree that need, has some dead limbs and stuff on it, so we're going to go ahead and take them off. So let me go ahead and get to it.
that was a little bit of a mistake. <laughs> um, that's all right though. That willow will grow right back within about a year. I meant to cut that little bitty piece off and I cut the whole branch off. No biggie. Um, like I said, this tree will grow back in no time from that. And uh, so look, I mean, we just spent three minutes and we pruned up this willow tree a little bit more than I actually intended to, unfortunately. But like I said, it'll grow itself back in a little bit of time. The hypo chain did a very good job and quick work. I'm going to do a little bit more work while I've got everything plugged in. But as you can see, we'll wrap this video up soon. So before we wrap this up, I just wanted to show you, here's what we cut off of the willow tree here. You can see some decent sized limbs that we cut. And then the one, was it that one right there that I accidentally cut that I didn't want to cut? I also went back here, cut away from the greenhouse a little bit. I think you can kind of see the difference now. Um, cleared out the peach tree back here a little bit. It did produce one peach already. It's only like two years old, so that's awesome. Uh, wife's done a great job in terms of gardening and getting produce and stuff out of the yard here. I might show that to y'all here in just a second. Um, knocked off a little bit of the magnolia that was around my tent right here. And uh, we'll cruise on. Why not show y'all? Because I knocked off a limb or two off of this willow in front that was starting to kind of hang over the driveway. But that's what the wife's got going on. We got some tomatoes going right here. Peppers on the back side right there. Some squash. And over there we got some lettuce. So that's really cool. Anyways, a couple of limbs off of this. Um, all in all, we'll walk to the front of the driveway here and show you what I put out at the road. So perk of living in the city limits is and there's a saw it did a great job the oil is working well the saw cut through uh, like a hot knife through butter which was excellent so I'll give you all a little bit of a look here at what we did I don't know if you can see all that stuff down there at the road about right there but we got a nice pile at the road not too much work thanks to this thing i've been wanting a pole saw so uh the fact that i got this on trade is going to work wonders around here because y'all can see that with that hypo 40 drive link chain we got a little bit of foliage to cut here every once in a while uh just to keep trimming it back and making it look good back here the mower situation doesn't look very good back there we're a little busy right now but the uh, foliage situation looks a lot better thanks to this hypo chain and uh, this Remington saw. So there it is guys, uh, Remington pole saw, got the 40 drive link chain, hypo's got some killer deals especially on the 39 drive link chain and uh, the 40 uh, drive links a little bit more but still a good deal overall. Worked excellent for me here with this uh, Remington pole saw. Y'all saw all the stuff that I cut made quick, easy work of it. I couldn't ask for much better, honestly. So, uh, worked out great. Remember, one of these could be yours. I've got uh, three 39 links and I think two 40 drive link chains. Uh, those who win that will also get one of the keychains that I showed y'all just a minute ago, right here. And. Uh, if you don't win one of the coupons to get a free chainsaw chain, you have an additional five opportunities to win this right here. All you got to do is comment your favorite chainsaw brand down in the comment section below. All the comment usernames, only one entry obviously, and all the username comments will be put in a uh, random character random generator prize wheel and the first five names will get a chain and a hammer bottle opener keychain and then the last five winners will get this hammer bottle opener keychain only still better than nothing 
I couldn't do this without y'all. Y'all subscribe. Y'all like the videos. Companies like Hypa partner with me, and they allow me to do these giveaways. It's really a win-win for everybody. They've been a great company to me. I know a lot of folks in the small engine community see them as a very reputable aftermarket uh, dealer now. And they've definitely made a name for themselves since I started working with them almost two years ago. Thank you, Hypa, Colin, Eddie, all those guys over there um, who work with me for getting this up and uh, getting it going. This is going to be a great giveaway. Again, Sunday evening at 8 o'clock, which would be the 16th will be when this giveaway session closes. And I will do the drawing on Monday, that following Monday, which would be the 17th. So thank you all again for watching. Hope I've made everything clear in uh, about the giveaway. Pretty simple. Comment your favorite chainsaw brand. You get entered to win. You can live in the United States, you can live internationally, it doesn't matter. The only thing that would matter is if you won one of the chains and you live internationally um, and you use the coupon to buy it off of Hypa and um, you would just have to pay the shipping for it. And that's it. That's the only catch here, guys. Thank you all again for watching and I will catch you all on the next video. Best of luck to all those who enter. Please do enter. Um, all you got to do is type a word down in the comments. You never know what you can win. Y'all take care, and I'll catch you on the next video. See you then.